My cat is attacking my foot and I can't think. Hey YouTube. <laughs> hey YouTube. Today we are continuing our first time playthrough of Mass Effect. Uh, we plan, we're plan. we going to be playing the entire series. And so we started off uh, last time with just kind of getting into the game, laying the groundwork, figuring out the universe, hearing about some of the characters and stuff like that. And now we can start progressing the story a little bit and learning more about our abilities and stuff. I was not very good about using the abilities and equipment that they gave me. So I'm going to do everything in my power this time around to actually do that in a better way. Um, so let's get into it and see what more things we learn about the universe. Thanks and I hope you enjoy the video. All right, here we go. Back into it. I love the design of this ship specifically. I don't know exactly what it is. What? This is it. The very heart of the Citadel, the turn pinnacle it up a bit. of galactic power. Kind of makes your head spin if you think about it too much. So, this is where the Council passes judgment on all this little folks. <laughs> Ever get the feeling ran over our heads, Commander? I love the fact that if you just take out your weapon and aim, that your teammates immediately do that too. Their rider dies for real. All right. Oh, didn't mean to do that. That's okay. Guy's up to something. Which guy? What guy? Oh. <laughs> the one over by the keeper. I wonder if this is the keeper. What? Oh well, no, I wasn't. Uh huh. Uh huh. What were you doing to the keeper, Chorbon? Um. Yes. Is there something you want? Following the keepers, eh? Why are you so interested in the keepers? It's a good question. Keepers. I've got no interest in the keep. Don't get coy. Mm, you know what I saw. Ashley's sassy. Uh, yeah. I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. We're just talking. Is there something wrong with That's that? Dumb. No. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the keepers. Okay. So far, I've had mixed results. Oh, the keepers the are the ones that are taking care of this thing and keeping up with it. I guess that's why they're called the keepers. Uh, the ones that they said that they don't really know too much about, so he's trying to learn about it. I see, I see. Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Mm -hmm. Well... Technically, we're not supposed to disturb the Keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. Let me help. I could help you out. I'm not worried about the authorities. Oh, we think we're I above the law, we as we are. I'm with the Alliance I'm Commander brother. Shepard, with the Alliance military. Hmm. Well, I, I suppose I could use the help. You'll need this. It's the scanning device I developed. Activate it each time you see a keeper. Okay. All collected data will automatically upload to my database. I'll even send a few credits your way for each cool. unique scan. What are you doing with the data once you've scanned it? Trying to learn whatever I can about the keepers. Makes sense. We see them working everywhere, yet we know so little. For how long we've been on there? It's crazy that I'm we don't scientist. know that much. I want to know what makes them tick. I should get going then. Makes sense. Yes, I have much work myself. So long, and good luck with the. Good scan. luck with the learning about the keepers. Hope it goes well. The keeper scan has been uploaded to the database. Okay, we got 30 coins and something else for that. I wonder how long it's going to take me to get acclimated to the running. It still feels so strange. Okay, that's not a doorway you can go into. Is there a way to sheathe my weapon? Is it called sheathing if it's a gun? Holster. No, it's not called a sheath. Those are two different things. Holster my weapon is what I'm looking for. We could just take this rapid transit. But also, we need to see if we can talk to any of these people. Hello. I forgot what you're called with your special hair, but... I guess it's probably just part of your head, not really your hair, but maybe it is. Oh, it said Keeper. Keeper? I hardly know her. Aha! 30 more credits and 12 EXP. Is it actually? I think it's just XP. Oh, what did I just do? There's the holster. I found out the button for it. All right. Oh, we learned. We're learning three things right now. The Asari, nope. The second species to join the Citadel, the Salarians, Salarians. are warm-blooded amphibians with a hyperactive metabolism. Amphibians. Think fast, talk fast, and move fast. To Solarians, other species seem sluggish and dull-witted. Unfortunately, their metabolic speed leaves them with a relatively short oh, lifespan. Oh, wow. Solarians over the age of 40 
are a rarity. That's sad. The Solarians were responsible for advancing the development of the primitive Krogan species to use as soldiers during the Rachni Wars. Dang. They were also behind the creation of the genophage bioweapon the Turians used to quell the Krogan rebellion several centuries later. Impressive Solarians. Solarians are known for their observational they gotta get a lot done with their little limited time span. Thinking. This manifests as an aptitude for research and espionage. They are constantly experimenting and inventing, and it is generally accepted that they always know more than they are. Roughly 1,200 years. All right, sh sh stop roughly... talking, stop. Oops, After wrong, wrong one. The Geth, nope. when the Asari we discovered the Citadel, they also discovered the Keepers, a docile, multi-limbed insect race that seemingly race. exists only to I maintain is, but... and repair the Great Prothean Station. Early attempts to communicate with or study the Keepers were failures, and it is not how long illegal their life to is. interfere with or impede Keeper activity. Because they are completely non-threatening, Keepers have become virtually invisible to everyone hmm. else. Similarly, they seem to be hard to miss. To other species, except for their tendency to help new arrivals integrate themselves into the city. They even help the original. No matter how many keepers die due to old age, violence, or accident, they huh. maintain a constant number. No one has discovered the source of new keepers, but some hypothesize they are genetic constructs, biological androids Seems created somewhere deep to in me. the inaccessible core of the citadel itself. Citadel is repairing itself via. Biotics is oh, the ability is of rare individuals to manipulate dark energy. Oh wait, we're doing the a wrong virtual one. intelligence is an advanced form of user interface software. V Vi. VIs use a variety oh, of methods to simulate natural. <laughs> I was thinking it was like Vi, like in, uh... including an audio interface and an avatar personality to interact with. Although a VI can provide a convincing emulation of sentience, they are not self-aware. Nor can they learn or take independent action. Got there, Richard. VIs are used as operating systems on commercial and home computers. Basically, is Cortana. Minimal VI agents are also available. Agents are compact agents. and specialized. Okay, that's Cortana. Some serve as personal secretaries, filtering calls and scheduling meetings based on user-defined priorities. I want my own VI. Are advanced search engines, I'm going to call them VIs if I like it better. Across the extranet to collate user-requested data. Commercial VIs in a variety of stock personalities are available at any software retailer. Boutique mm. firms and hobbyists also build unique VIs for Probably a sassy. I would prefer a sassy one because then they'll check me out a lot of things. Although software emulation of living personalities is illegal, reconstructions of famous historical figures oh, wow. are common. You just choose Bionic. some random person. Jesus. Make the Lorb my my VI. Speak to Harkin. Go to Korra's Den in the lower wards and speak with Harkin, a seasick agent who might know where Garrus can be found. All right. Why is it saying that I have more here? You need to find some proof that Saren is connected with the Geth. Got it. We know where that Koran thing was because we were there earlier. So I guess we just go back where we came from. I wonder if it'll let me go through the store or are I was supposed to take that other way? Not sure. Oh my gosh, we have no stamina. We're so slow and weak. This is over at least down at the Presidium. There you'll find the Embassy's Citadel Tower. I thought that this music it was playing in this elevator was my cat. I started looking around. That actually, it was so subtle. I thought it was my cat scratching its neck. There you'll find the Embassy's, the Citadel Tower, the Emporium, the Bake, and the Consort Chambers. Behind you is the Citadel Tower. Council convenes. Okay, yeah, I mean, this way, right? But I can't. Oh. There we go. Oh! Oh! Why are we standing in his face like that? I can't move. I can't believe the council ignored all the evidence against Saren. Itchy eye. One of their best operatives. It's only natural they take his word for ours. Classic Karth being our left hand man. Oh, so now we just chase leads while this smug Turian runs around with his guest troopers. That's politics, Chief. I feel very uncomfortable the way I'm just staring at this man. I also hate politics. Hey, look, another thing to record. Look at that bug thing over there. Ooh, level up. Wait, that's the first time I did that sound, I think. Oops, wrong button. Squad. All right. It doesn't look like it's gonna let us go up and charm. 
which is fine. How many do we have? Three. Should I should I use my pistol more often? It's kind of my whole ability thing, so. Grants the marksman ability. I wonder what the marksman ability is. What, what does this thing say I need? That's what I kind of thought. Purges weapon heat. I kind of love that. Barrier unlocked. Oh. I don't, I don't exactly know what that means, but that's okay. Here you go. Oh, what a soldier. This helps her increase health, allows limited health regeneration. Okay. Love that for you. What's Barrier again? He makes his own kinetic shields. Got it. Why does it keep saying that there's something left here? I keep clicking everything and it's not... Oh, now it's gone. Please do not disturb the keepers. Oh, well, I just scanned it. Don't worry. Ooh, another one on the left. Look, they're free real estate. Oh, what is this guy? Okay, cool. It's like a flamingo, but... Do you desire to learn of the Enkindlers? Or has the honorable CSEC officer enlisted assistance? Uh, tell me everything. Why is the CSEC officer harassing you? The CSEC officer requests oh that God. this one purchase an evangelical permit to spread the truth of the Enkindlers. I'd like to investigate. If that's all the CSEC officer wants, why not just buy the permit? The truth of the Enkindlers is universal. This one humbly this believes one that humbly the truth believes. should not be suppressed. He's calling himself this one. Exacting payment as a means of imposing limits upon the truth is an abrogation of this one's religious freedom. Legality of preaching. So you're breaking the law by preaching without a permit right now? The CSEC officer states that preaching in this place is forbidden, and preaching anywhere on the Citadel requires a permit. This one humbly I love his voice. His they do really well with the, the, the voice the effects. And thus, no permit should be necessary. But not preaching to this. Submits that it is not preaching to state the truth. I mean, that makes sense to me. Who are the Enkindlers? Your people know them as the Protheans. Oh. They are the true creators of this one's people. Oh. The Enkindlers raised the Hanar from ignorance into consciousness by granting this one's people the gift of speech. Oh, wow. Hanar. Let me talk to the CSEC officer. Perhaps I can charm. explain Charm! Here comes my charm! This one would be most grateful for the assistance. Please let this one know if success is achieved. I'm gonna start calling myself this one. That Hanar refuses to listen to reason. Why can't it act in an orderly and lawful manner? It's not smart enough. Be more open-minded. Let the Hanar talk. What's the problem? Are there laws being broken here? I am not unreasonable. The Hanar is free to spew its nonsense once it purchases an evangelical permit. Mm -hmm. Um. Investigate. So if the Hanar gets a permit, it's allowed to preach? No. Registered oh. evangelicals must follow regulations. There are specific areas where preaching is If needed. it's just stating facts, Failure why does it need a permit? Regulations results in the forfeiture of the license. Reason for permit. What's the purpose behind the evangelical permits? How do I be on the side Forcing of the thing? Forcing evangelicals to register for a permit weeds out undesirables. It keeps the area safe. The nah, Citadel is too I'm tired of that. to become a battleground for a religious war. If you'd like, I could talk to the Hanar for you. I have argued with the stubborn jelly all afternoon. You are certainly welcome to try. I don't... I don't like how this is Has going. Has the CSEC officer been assuaged? Not yet. I'll keep working on it. Okay. This one will continue to spread its... Any progress with that Hanar? Let the Hanar talk. I think you should let the Hanar preach in the Presidium. The Presidium is a place of culture and respect. It is its it own culture. With zealots shouting their idiocy. Okay, calm down. Why should the jellies get special treatment? Jellies! How dare you? Laws. Why can't I use these? I have level three charm. That's not fair. I can't level up my charm anymore. 
What if I bought a permit? If I purchased the evangelical permit myself, would that take care of things? No, because it still wouldn't be in the as right long place. As it stays in approved areas once it has the permit. Yes, that would solve the issue for me. I'll be back. Let's talk to the Hanar and see what, what he says. To do. Just get rid of that Hanar. You're toxic. Classic police. Has the CSEC officer been assuaged? Um, this isn't. Is there. this really how you want to represent the Enkindlers? The truth of the Enkindlers must be made known. He's so. He's they so. They gave the Hanar language and gave the universe calm. the mass relays. This one only wishes to spread the truth to any who will listen. There is no intent. Yeah, you're not doing trouble. anything wrong. I agree. What if I purchase the evangelical permit for you? What do you think about that? Finances are only a partial limitation. This one does not believe. I'm inclined to believe in the preaching to honor. The truth. Never thought I'd say that, but. However, this one also does not possess the 150 credits necessary to purchase the permit. You do now. 150 credits? This should cover you. I wonder how many I had. This is a most appreciated action. You are not of the Hanar. Gotta stick but you together. Wish to help spread the truth of the Enkindlers. This one will not cause any further trouble for the CSEC officer. This one offers its thanks. This one. I don't even know where to see how much money I have. I see the Hanar is left. Thank you. Uh, I don't really like that. Happy to help. Here, for your assistance. Oh, in this uh, now if you'll excuse me, I should report to my superiors. What do we get? XP, Metagel, and a journal entry. I love it when people give me a journal entry for. The the Hanar are a citadel species known for completing a quest. Politeness. They speak with scrupulous precision and take offense at improper language. Hanar that expect Luckily, to we deal didn't with defend it in any way. That's good. Courses to help them unlearn their tendency to take offense at improper speech. All Hanar take have two special names. courses. The face name is known to the world. Oh, the soul name cool. is kept for use among close friends. It's like Aragon. Hanar never refer to themselves in the first person in conversation with someone they know on a face name basis. Wow. To do so is considered egotistical. It's like Twitch so names or YouTube comment names. This one or the impersonal your fake hit. names to their me home world, Kajay, and then so I now y'all need to refer to me as an that one white star resulting in a permanent blanket of cloud due to the presence of Prothean ruins on mm. the world many Hanar worship them and Hanar myths often speak of an elder race that civilized them by teaching them language got it cool we're learning things. Oh, did we do that? Sorry. <laughs> Scan. We got 30 credits for that. Like we're getting all the credits in the world just by touching these little spider people. So what's 150 credits to help out a little Hanar, you know? Why is this guy bothering her? Excuse me. Is this guy bothering you, miss? Oh, I'm bothering you. Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that. Move along. Move along. Alright, if I was the map to get away from where I am now and instead go to where I'm supposed to go, where would I be? Citadel Rapid Transit. Avena. Zoom out. Can we zoom out more? Oh, that's zoom in. I was pressing the opposite button. Emporium. We're supposed to go. Citadel Rapid Transit. Consort chambers. We're supposed to go to Korgurgan. CSA Academy. No. Cor Corlin. Citadel Tower. Where the hell am I? Let's run around and just explore. I'm sure we'll figure it out. Hello. Let me put my gun away. Not scare these people off. Hello. Bar Lavand. Ooh, you look fancy. What's this? One of the Earth Clan. It's like a bane. Ah, very famous one, yes. You are the one called Shepherd. The tale of how oh, you survived gosh. the great tragedy on Akuz is truly remarkable. It's I am amazed breath. each time I hear it. 
Who are you? You've got me at a disadvantage here. Who Forgive are me, you? Earth Clan. My name is Barla Vaughn. My job makes it necessary for me to keep informed. I am a financial advisor to many important clients here on the Citadel. When someone as important mm. as yourself arrives on the station, I take notice. Investigate. Personal questions. Tell me more about your job. Galactic finance is incredibly complex. A mix of laws and regulations from dozens of interstellar economies. I'm an expert in how all these mm. economies interact. For a fee, I share my expertise. I see, I see. I also offer premium services for those clients who need someone to conduct business without drawing unwanted mm -hmm. attention. I see. Uh, you're one of those. Is this legal? I will make it legal. Sounds pretty shady. Everything I do falls completely within the bounds of interstellar commerce law. Even so, every time I read the word interstellar, I can only think of undisclosed. <laughs> For example, suppose a Hanar yeah. ambassador was petitioning the council to reduce tariffs on Hanar goods. How would it look if he had money invested in a Hanar exporting company? Even if his true motives were to help his people. I don't like that me just loading into the game changed my graphics. For his own personal gain. So I can see that the I colors are off, and that's probably why I thought that my hair looked private. crazy, but it probably doesn't even look that crazy. Citadel. What's it like living here on the Citadel? The station is, without a doubt, the greatest wonder in the galaxy. It is a technological marvel, but its true splendor goes much deeper than the hull and engines. Okay. From the Presidium to the wards, the entire station is a testament to the success of the Council. All the species of Citadel spaced together in a single strong community. What makes the Presidium so special? It is the political center of Citadel space. 80% of all intelligent species in the known galaxy acknowledge the Council's authority on interstellar matters. But only the most powerful and influential species have embassies the people in the here in the Presidium. Ter this terminus? level of the station is reserved for the elite, right? shepherd, people like, like us. What are the wards like? The cultural heart of the galaxy. They pulse with the lifeblood of millions of citizens from dozens of different species. You never know what you'll find down in the wards, Commander. It's always full of surprises. Fortunately, most of them are pleasant. We already did all that. All right. Well, thanks nice for you your go. time. Lovely to meet you. Goodbye. Stay Commander. safe. Breathe well. Elevator Downs is to the plaza on the other side of the lake. There you will find Chorus Den. Okay. So we should go left. The elevator down to the wards is located across the plaza on the other side of the lake. See, now what does that mean? Because the arrow is pointing this way. Wards. Cora's Den. Here we go. See, I told you we would figure it out. I knew we would. Not even a problem for us. I knew what I was doing all along. You have arrived at Cora's Den. A gentleman's club in the wards. Nothing gentlemanly about the people that come here. Maybe. I actually don't know even what it looks like, so. Is it going to be a lot of alien... Booba being sh shaken. Oh, look, scan. Boop. It's a good thing that I talked to that guy pretty early on. I think that I'm going the wrong way. Presidium, nah. Hello. Hope y'all having fun. Oh, maybe this is a gentleman's club. This doesn't seem so bad. Scenic view, observe. Wow, now that's one scenic view. I sure am glad that I'm observing right now. Big place. That your professional opinion, sir? Damn, she's so snappy. Scope is amazing. He's right, Chief. This isn't a station; it's a city. There must be millions here. Can't be possible yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. They said trillions. This makes Jump Zero look like a portage on, and it's ah, the largest ah, deep ah, space ah. station the Alliance has. Jump Zero is big, but 
This is a whole nother scale. Look at the ward arms. How do they keep all that mass from flying apart? We have to work to measure up. Melting pot is inadequate. Big club. Why keep humans out? The council represents more races than I thought. No wonder they're careful with. It's not exactly what I was thinking he was going to say, but that's okay. Keep everything running. It has to be hard keeping all these cultures working together. I believe it. Or maybe they just don't like humans. What's not to like? Why not? We've got oceans. <laughs> what? And they don't have those? They have everything they want. If you they don't have. They don't fall in love. Oil, Wait, that's sad. Thigh high boots. I want dinner first. Sir. Oh. I think she kind of just flirted with me a little bit. It's all right. At ease, Lieutenant. Can't see her in a skirt anyway. Damn straight, you can't. Oh, she will, she up, wants. Sir. She wants me. But it might just be a power dynamic thing. She might not actually like me. You know, she just. She just respects me a lot. Me, Emily Wong. I'm Emily Hello. Wong. I'm an investigative journalist working here on the Citadel. Could I have a moment of your time? Yeah, let's hear it. What do you need? I've been hunting for evidence of corruption and organized crime on the Citadel, but there are places mm. I can't go. I was We're laying down all the groundwork for these side quests right now. Investigation. I can make it worth your time. Investigate. How investigate? How do you know linked? that my investigation is going to uncover anything you need? You wouldn't be investigating if it weren't big. And if it's big, it's something I'd like to hear about. How do you know I'm investigating anything here on the Citadel? Ooh. I'm a good journalist, Commander Shepard. Word gets around. We'll see. No promises. But if I find anything relating to your we'll case... We'll see. I don't know about Thank that. You, we'll Commander. find out. You won't regret it. She looks kind of... She has the same similar hairstyle with like Ada Wong. Wait a second. There's two of her. Or maybe it's still her. And she just found another person and talked to you immediately afterwards. I thought she walked the other direction though. Oh, this poor guy's just standing alone. Or, 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 or lady. Or, or they, them. Hello. Nope, there's another one. There's a lot of Emily Wongs walking around here. No. Okay. Look, I know it was you. I remember your face. Really, that's impressive. Usually you humans can't tell one turn. Hey, we have the same hair. What? No, no, I, I, I don't think you ever gave me one. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't. What, 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 you... can't help it. what a great interaction that was. Not really my kind of place, but there sure are some spectacular views here. Okay, another keeper. Uh, expat. Volus shopper. Hello, Earth Clan. No doubt you've just thing. come back from the colonies. Will you be needing supplies? You know what? Sure. Show me what you've got. Let's take a look. Most excellent. I am sure you will find. Oh, eighty thousand. So we probably should start saving, because we probably have no money. We have fourteen hundred. Oh look, a cool arm thing. Cipher tool, Omni tool, multi-purpose diagnostic and manufacturing tools used for a variety of battlefield tasks. That looks sick. It reminds me of something, but I can't think of what off the top of my head. I think that since we're just at the very beginning, 14, we have 1400. I misread. We don't even have 14,000. We have 1400 credits. I think that we should save our credits for now. Well, let's sell all junk. Oh wait, it doesn't even give me that option. Okay. <laughs> then let's leave because we're poor. Best place on this ward to buy upgrades. If you have money, which we don't. Conrad Werner. Is that your Commander Shepard? Hey, we have. The hero of Eden <laughs> we look identical. I am so honored same hairstyle, you. same facial hair. Pleasure, all mine. Hello, who are you? Do I know you? How does everyone know me? How does every single person in this entire station know me? Uh, no, no, I'm just a fan. One oh, of your biggest fans. fans, actually. My name is Conrad. Conrad Werner. They say you killed more than a hundred Geth on Eden Prime. Yeah, that's not exactly about right. I spend most of the time trying to stay alive and help the colonists. 
Hey, uh, I know you're probably busy, but um, an autograph. This guy's crazy. Autograph. I suppose. It's a little bit weird if you Here ask you me, but sure. Thanks. He's creepy. Really There's something wrong with this person. My going to be so impressed. I'll let you get back to work. Oh, but next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. How about you buy me one of those fancy things that's inside of the store? I'm too poor right now. No. Okay. There are still stairs in the future. <sighs> I guess they don't want us to turn up like Wally. Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's Oh, he said shop. the thing. He said you the thing. Hello supply. there. Yes. Hello there. Let me see what you have. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. I'm still very good I'm things still I have. Poor. You will see. Ooh, non-human items. We're definitely gonna get party members that are non-human. Sixty-two thousand. Okay, see, we're just gonna hold up, hold please. No, this is leaving. We don't want to leave. Oh wait, two Cora's den. That's oh, him. wait, we're fighting? Assassin. Oh, it's the left stick. Nope. Wait. Oh. I don't know exactly what I just did. Those were sirens, man. Uh huh. That's it. Bag him and tag him. That's it. Bag him and tag him. Wait, where'd the other guy die? They didn't give any loot for me. Okay, so here's where the poopa was. Hooters. No, not Hooters. Uh, I can't remember what I was thinking. Wait, what? <laughs> I thought I was about to be talking. Relax. Sit forward? I just need to see what happens. Oh, God. Okay, okay, sit forward isn't like leaning in forward. It's just like sitting up straight. Okay, what a, what a great time that was. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm also poor, so I don't have any credits for you. Sorry. Thanks for the sh thanks for the show, though. All right. They're making out in front of a dancer. Kind of kind of respect that. I got business here, but not with you. Okay. He looks like uh the guy that sells the talks to, what's his name? Dax. He looks like Dax from Star Wars. Go away. He looks cool. Not now. Watching the show. Is that no? Aha! Uh -huh, here's Harkin. Fizz told us to take you down if you showed up. What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. Mm. This is Fizz's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. Not this straight. story is just beginning. Out of my way, humans. I have. What was that all about? Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. That doesn't sound like something that I'm gonna be very good at. I saw it say this name though. There you are. Alliance military. <laughs> I could have been a marine, you know. Okay. Instead, I joined the goddamn Citadel Security. Whatever you say, Grandpa. Take your meds. Harkin, right? I was told you could help me find someone. Turian C-Sec officer named Garrus. Garrus? <laughs> you must be one of Captain Anderson's crew. Poor bastard, still trying to bring Saren down. We are, but he I killed my friend Garrus, Nihilus. You gotta tell me something first. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? Ooh. Is there secret? something I should know about the captain? T. Spectre. Huh? Didn't Wait, what? That, did you? It was all very hush hush. The first human ever given that honor, oh. and then he blew it. Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Sarah. Mm. Says the Turians set him up. How do you know this? You said they covered all this up. How do you hear about it? Yeah. I spent 20 years working cases here on the Citadel. People on this station love to talk. 
Secrets are like herpes. If you got them, analogy. might as well spread them around. Interesting analogy. Interesting. Very interesting. Um, that's not why I'm here. Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side. Dr. Michelle. Last I heard, he was going back there. Start what do you Garrus. know about Garrus? Damn hothead is what he is. Still figures he can save the world. I what think Garrus is definitely going to be our teammate. He'll pay for it soon enough. The executor loves to put us lowly field agents in our place. Just look what happened to me. Stop crying. You need to look in a mirror. Ooh. Responsibility Tell him, yourself. John. Save your sermons. This ain't no church. All right, buddy. How well do you know Captain Anderson? Met him a few times over the years. One of those hardcore military guys. Yes, sir. No, sir. Can't have any fun with a stick up your ass, sir. That's probably why he climbed the Alliance rank so fast. Military loves yeah, they do. The captain's a good soldier. Sure, whatever. Dress him in a fancy suit, pin some shiny medals on his chest, and call him a hero. Everybody else does. Everybody else does. But if he's so great, why'd the Spectres kick him out? Why'd you go ask him about that? Still quit blaming others. Look in a mirror. Sober up and take some responsibility for yourself. Just keep saying the same line. Save your sermons. This ain't. And no I'll just keep giving the same comeback. What's it like working for CSEC? You mean what was it like? The executor suspended me without pay. Recurring violations. CSEC was keeping a file on me. Can you believe that? Yes, I can believe that. Every mistake I ever made went into the books. Get a little rough with a suspect. Note in the file. Have a couple of drinks on duty. Note in the file. <laughs> Skim a couple of credits off a drug bus, note in the file. That's it's not a, witch hunt. a witch hunt. That's you got off easy if you ask me. But what the hell you do being you rotten. Mean? Working for CSEC isn't like being a Marine. People get pissed off if we shoot somebody. Investigations, inquiries, rules, regulations. Every day I plow through enough red tape to choke a rhino. That's how you gotta be to do this job. So don't talk to me about right and wrong. You soldiers got it easy. You need sober up and look at the mirror. Sober up and take some responsibility for yourself. Hey, Queen Pritchett, this ain't church. This ain't no church. You're with us. I'm out of here. Yeah. Yeah, good. Go. Let me drink in peace. You're worth this. Yeah. One day it'll let me shoot one of these people. One day. Garrus went to the med clinic in the upper wards to follow up with the lead on Saren. Med clinic in the upper wards. Be on the lookout for information that might help Miss Wong. You probably haven't seen the last of Conrad. What harm would there be in talking to him if you meet him again? again. I've already forgotten who Conrad is. Is that the the two guys that were talking? The Geth, the Krogan, evolved in a okay. hostile and vicious environment. Until the invention of gunpowder Krogan. weapons, eaten by predators was still the number one cause of Krogan oh fatality. Gosh. Afterwards, it was death by gunshot. When the Salarians discovered them, the Krogan American were a things. brutal, primitive species, struggling to survive a self-inflicted nuclear winter. The Salarians oh. culturally uplifted them, teaching them to use and build modern technology so they could serve as soldiers in the Rachni War. Okay, that's kind of crazy. Liberated from the harsh conditions Just of doing good things for them so they can the use them as bait. Krogan experienced an unprecedented population explosion. They began to colonize the nearby worlds. Krogan. Even though these worlds were already inhabited, the Krogan rebellions lasted nearly a century, only ending when the Turians unleashed the Genophage, a Salarian developed bioweapon that crushed all Krogan oh. resistance. The Genophage makes only one in a thousand pregnancies viable. Oh, and today, wow. the Krogan are a slowly dying breed. Understandably, the Krogan harbor a grudge against all other species. Yeah, I mean, that does Turians. make sense. They went the Zeke route for Attack on Titan. That's insane. That is absolutely next level. Majority of the Citadel's population lives in the wards, the five massive arms of the station that house the residential and commercial districts. Many galactic races have established cultural enclaves there. Wait a second. Talk, 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 talk. Okay, okay, we're fine, we're fine.
Population density and cost of living are extremely high, akin to Earth cities such as Hong Kong and Singapore. <sighs> the wards are open topped with sky skyscrapers rising from the superstructure. Towers are sealed against the vacuum as the breathable atmosphere envel envelop it's only maintained to a height of about seven meters. The atmosphere is contained by the centrifugal force and rotation of membrane of dense colorless sulfur hexafluoride gas held in place by carefully managed mass effect fields. The view from the words is spectacular in the background stars, serpent nebula, and the nearby blue giant called the Widow move across the sky as the station rotates to stabilize itself. In the foreground, the lights of the buildings and vehicles on opposing ward arms are perpetually shining. The Citadel has no real day or night, while the station keeps the standard galactic time for political functions, businesses rarely close, and residents acclimate to sleep and work according to personal need rather than a day-night cycle. Mm. That would be insane to deal with. I can't imagine. It just kind of... I wonder if all the races sleep in a similar way or not. Additions and modifications are constantly being constructed, though they must stay within certain specifications that will not compromise the operation of the station. Occasionally, the keepers will descend... See, that's what I... Oh, that's... Yeah, keepers. Okay, that is what they are. Will descend on an area of the wards and move or change the architecture without explanation. Residents have learned to live with these inex uh, inexplicable intrusions. I really wish they would have told us all of the amount of time, like life expectancy of all the races. They only told us about the ones, the Solarians. Standard credit was established by the Citadel's Unified Banking Act as the currency of interstellar trade. The credit has a managed floating exchange rate. Calculated in real time by the central bank to maintain the average value of participating currencies. Some regional currencies are worth more than a credit and some less. Hard currency can be stolen or counterfeited, so electronic fund transfers are the norm. More importantly, physical transactions cannot be easily tracked, making them ideal for tax evasion or the purchase of illegal goods. When the Alliance joined the Citadel, its various national treasuries were linked into the credit network. A human with a bank account of Mexican pesos, Japanese yen, or Indian rupees can purchase any item in credits at a fair market value. All economies that participate in the credit network are required to price items in both local currency and credits. That's cool that that just does it automatically. Wish that we had something like that without us having to pay fees. Like, obviously you can do exchange and stuff, but big fees almost every single time you do that. Okay, I was about to say, this girl's really short, but then I just learned that she's just on her knees, that's all. Krogan Bouncer. Okay, this is the guy that was talking the before. Rooms are private, reserved for Fist and his friends. Investigate. Fist. Who's Fist? He owns this club, oh, okay. but the customers have to stay out front. He has small hands for how big his head is. What did that other Krogan want? Rex? Personal matter. Not real chatty, is he? <laughs> no, he is not. Goodbye. Goodbye. Enjoy the club. You know I will. Thanks, Krogan. Krogan Bouncer. Yeah, that is. It's not his job. Seems seems plausible. I thought no one heard us just lighting up those other people earlier. Let's see about up here. Door control. What is up this way? Did I go in the big circle? I think I did. Which is fine. I'm not good with directions. Aha! Nope, I've already touched you. Touch the keepers. Alright, that was the interest of the club. Oops. I keep thinking that's gonna be the map, and then it is it just isn't all right it says upper words is where we want to go presidium citadel rapid transit lower markets flux csec academy go to the med clinic why is this an exclamation mark plot i guess we should go down there and check that then if it's part of the plot is this towards the alleyway? Mm, this is. Upper markets are beyond the far door. Continue down the stairs through the. Okay, what does this one say? Med clinic. 
It's at the end of the wards. The elevator sees Academy is located on the stairs. I think that this is actually where we want to go, though. Right? Does this look good? Where is my arrow? Where am I? Zoom in. Okay, I'm lost. Where is my arrow? Set destination, this. Now it should pulse towards it, no? Okay, here we go. Oh, those blue dots are me. Don't mind me. I knew that the entire time. I was just checking to make sure that y'all knew that those blue dots were me. Didn't it should I have a big arrow before? Okay, it's fine. Hello. View of Nebula, might as well. Oh. Okay. Could leave or we could not. Big scan, 30 plus credits. Huge for us. <laughs> we run like a dork. How does everyone, every single person that is here, every single woman that is in this area, looks exactly like Wong? Officer Lang. Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? Everyone knows me. I'm famous. They got a whole I have a monument? You. It's a miracle you survived. All I want in life is to have someone build a statue over me. I'm sorry. Of I just me. never thought I'd meet Not someone like me. you in person. Uh, my name's Lang, Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. Eddie Lang. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? Uh, I guess a lot. Why'd you join Citadel Security? I don't know. Let me just Seems ask like you some right personal questions do, you know? real quick. Maybe it's in my blood. My grandfather was a cop back on Earth. It's kind of what CSEC is, police for the Citadel. I'm still pretty new at it, but I like it so far. Way more interesting than staying back on Earth. Yeah, I believe you it. You gotta meet all kinds of cool aliens, like those Hanar. And are cool. I like Plus, them. Plus, CSEC gets a lot of respect here. We uphold the law. People, even aliens, appreciate that. How do you like working here on the Citadel? This place he is just amazing. talked about how much you loved it. I've been here almost a year, question. and I still haven't seen a tenth of it. The Presidium's just so beautiful. Good place to go and relax. But I really like it here down in the wards. There's always something going on somewhere. I like his cinnamon bun like that new club that just opened a few months ago. Flux. Wicked scene in there, Commander. You should check it out when you have some time. Oh, you know me. I'm what a clubber. What do you know about the Spectres? Just the stuff they show in the vids. They always make them out to be super agents on secret missions to save the galaxy. I know it's not really like that, though. What is it Some like? Some of the other CSEC guys don't like them too much. Figure they shouldn't be able to operate outside the law. But if they were so bad, the council wouldn't use them, right? Right. Do you know a CSEC officer named Harkin? Oh, we already I talked about I shouldn't really say too much. He's been on the force a lot longer than me. But I've heard things, you know? Drinking on the job, taking bribes, that kind of thing. Rumors mostly, but they suspended him, so some of it must be true. Yep, I agree. I have to go. Right. You're probably real busy. Nice to meet you, See Officer you Lang. Later. See you next time. What is this? Public extranet terminal. Oh. Got a codex. Technology. Why is it this one? While convoys allow rapid transmission, there is a finite amount of bandwidth available. Given the trillions of people may be trying to pass a message to a given buoy at any time, access to the network is parceled out on priority tiers. Citadel Council and the Spectres have absolute priority. If they are using all the bandwidth, everyone else must wait. It's like Twitch partners. Individual governments and their militaries enjoy the next highest tier. During wartime, Civilian communication can suffer hours or even days of lag. Intelligence agencies study ping time through various systems to predict military buildups. Below the governments and militaries, bandwidth priority is sold to the highest bidder. Media conglomerates, particularly headline news networks, purchase higher priority to provide their viewers with timely information. Corporations that require timely information and response capability, for example, financial institutions and investment firms, also invest heavily in priority access. The funds acquired through sales of bandwidth are used to maintain and expand the communications infrastructure. While everyone with a computer has guaranteed free and unlimited access to the gal galactic extranet, hmm, <laughs> I just realized, extranet, internet, I see. They are last in line for bandwidth and may have to wait for their request to be processed. Bandwidth resale corporations use investment capital to purchase blocks of high priority access made available by paid subscription. For me. Ah, big yawn. Ah, uh, subscriptions, even in the future. 
We're all we're we're not getting away from it anytime soon. So it's surrounded by a blue tinted reflection nebula. The light of the nebula is actually light from the citadel scattered and reflected back at the station. At first, the serpent nebula was assumed to be made of microscopic construction debris. Prevailing theory holds that the Protheans used molecular nanotechnology to manufacture the incredibly durable materials used in the citadel. But unlike other nebulae, 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 the serpent does not dissipate over time. Therefore, it must be replenished constantly. The current popular theory is that the non-recyclable waste collected by the Citadel's keepers is somehow re rendered down to atomic or molecular level and ejected into the cloud. Oh wow. The thick nebula presents a navigation hazard. Beyond the relatively clear areas around the Citadel, electrical charges are common. These are not blocked by kinetic barriers and can severely damage metal frame starships. In addition, some dense knots of dusts can overwhelm the repulsion of kinetic barriers on smaller ships. If such a vessel is moving fast enough at the time, the effects are similar to being hit by a sand blaster. Ah, yes, yeah, sand blasters. I know about that. That happened all the time to me back in the day. <laughs> Attempting to reach the Citadel through open space navigation is unadvisable. The only, the only safe approach is through the various mass relays that orbit it. Okay, so there's a this nebula at the middle. And the keepers are thought to be what they think is non-recyclable waste. They take it back and chuck it back in there, and that's what keeps the source going. It's like a limited energy. Do I want to go to Seasack Academy? I don't I don't think so. I am not I am not where I'm supposed to be. Oops. Can I walk back up here and then put a mark where I'm supposed to be going? Okay, it says that there's a plot moving thing right here, but where? Put a marker on it. Every it's got to be through this doorway. How did I not go in here? Med clinic. Here I we didn't go. tell anyone. I swear. Oh. That was smart, Doug. Now if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth. <sighs> Oh Who are shit. You? Let her go. Oh! Wait, is that Garrus right now? Okay, Garrus, let's go. Over there. Wait, before I do any of this, I want to do this. Stop running. Oh, that was an insane shot. I want to use my abilities. <laughs> Map. Oh, I did the wrong thing. Okay. Oh well. Oh. Yes! <laughs> Finally! Finally I killed some of one of my abilities. Area secured. Um Oh, I could have probably shot that. What was I what did I wanna Can I set this to a different button? Or is it just stay as R1? Yeah, it just stays. That's okay though. All right, let's talk to Garrus. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. Nice shot. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get lucky. Okay, you were lucky. Michelle, are you hurt? Don't pretend, Garrus. No, I'm okay. Thanks to you, all of you. Who are those men? Why were they threatening you? Who do they work for? They work for Feast. Uh, they want you to shut me up. Keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. Quarian? What Quarian? A few days ago, a Quarian came okay, by I my office. I need to see which one's She'd a Quarian She'd been shot, again. but she wouldn't tell me who did it. Mm. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted ah, to trade information that's probably that guy from earlier. for a safe place to hide. Where'd she go? Where is she now? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Sarah. Uh... The Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid, even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. That Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. Something Saren wants, something that even this crossing Shadow Broker to get. She must have something that proves he's a traitor. Uh -huh. Did the Quarian mention anything about Sarah or the Geth? Makes sense. She did. 
We need to find the, this Quarian stat. Had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. We need to find her. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. Yes. I'm coming with you. Of course. But I do want to know why he hates Saren. You're a Turian. Well. Why do you want to bring him down? I couldn't find the proof I needed in my investigation, but I knew what was really going on. Saren is a traitor to the Council and a disgrace to my people. Major case. Okay. Welcome aboard, Garrus. Welcome aboard. You know, we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex. Yeah, to okay. Take that makes sense. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. We could use him? We could use him. A Krogan might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC ah. Academy. What's he doing there? Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he okay, leaves. Okay, it's all starting to line up well. Move out. Ah, okay, so now we do need to choose... Oh, add to squad. You, you can have... Oh... So it's still just two. We're definitely gonna keep him. Combat strength very high. Examine. He's on the same level as me. Ashley has a lot of combat strength, but no tech strength. Garrus has a lot of tech strength. I have all the biotic strength I need. What is What does he bring to the table? If I were to do this. I am doing something wrong. There we go. Caden also has biotic strength. But like biotic only really helps in fights, no? I mean it's better than only having combat. Let's keep let's do this for now. No, no, let's not. Let's do let's keep Ashley with us. I like the attitude. Need to keep it a little bit of spice around. I never properly thanked you for saving me from Fist's thugs, Commander. All in a day's I work, know madam. What would have happened if you hadn't been there. Happy to help. I'm just glad you weren't hurt. Me too. Now, is there anything you need? With? You're See. a doctor. How did you end up here? You really on encroach on people's My personal matters very quickly. When I was young. My father was a medic. They're very, Alliance. they're very open though. It doesn't really to matter the too much. I medical tradition alive, but not the military. Fixing up wounded soldiers isn't my idea of fun. Uh. Oh. Let me take a look at what you have for sale. Of course. I'm not going to spend any money. Medical Exoskeleton 8. 420,000 credits. Prototype upgrading combining numerous advanced medical technologies to honor and regulate all vital systems. 3.5 health regeneration. 50% doctor. That's all? It doesn't even seem like it has that much stuff for being 420,000 credits. I'm sure we'll have to buy stuff that's like smaller sometime, but not yet. It'll wrap a chance at. Wait, 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 wait. Let me back in here. This is not the drawer I thought it was. Replenish med gel. Oh, cool. That's nifty. Wasn't there an, an elevator to CSEC right here? No. Or not CSEC, the academy. Is it down the stairs? What is this? I don't know. Oh, we gotta level up. Intimidate, no! Increase credits gained when selling items in stores. Intimidating options will be grayed out if you don't have enough. You skill rank. Okay, but there's not a light side and dark side situation. Wait, what is Paragon? What does the Paragon mean? Is that light side and dark side? Renegade, Paragon. I need to know what these things mean. Should I Google it? I feel like this is important. Why does it want me to intimidate? I feel like intimidating is so bad. I'm not gonna use intimidate. I, I'm not, I refuse. I refuse to be the bad guy. But maybe doing intimidate allows me to do more charm too. Oh. 
Recharge all talents so they can be used immediately. Okay. When does that happen? That's another ability that I have now. Oh my god, he has 12 points. Let's definitely focus on the decryption. Let's see what happens if we do auto. Oh my god, he did so much assault rifle stuff. Uh, I'm gonna undo all of this. And you're gonna go crazy on the... You're gonna be our decryption le legend. Increases radius and strength of sabotage. Can use description skill on average objects. Does 100 damage in an 8 meter radius. Oh, this is... Okay, what is... Increase the amount of on each other covered. Let's you use the decryption skill to open secure objects. Yeah, you're going to be our little hacker man. Uh, able to clip light armor. We can do three here. Take a couple of these. What is damping? Decrease the explosion radius. Protect by from the And then clearly the game wanted you to have some assault rifle ability. So there you go. Now you're looking well-rounded. And very technologically savvy. I love that for you. Assault rifles, combat armor, assault training, soldier. Increased health allows limited health regeneration. Okay, she's pretty she's pretty straightforward. She just shoots good and stays alive. Take she takes damage, she doesn't die, and she shoots good. Good soldier. Follows orders. Increases hardening. All right. Expose Saren. Bist, a crime lord hiding out at a bar called Kora's Den in the lower wards, is meeting with the Corian, who has proof that Saren's going to work with working with the Geth. Rex, the Krogan bounty hunter, is being questioned at the Seasec Academy. You can meet him there if you want to speak to him. It's definitely like a side thing. First, let's learn about the Driven from oh. their home system by the <gasps> Geth nearly three centuries ago, most mm. Quarians now live aboard the migrant fleet, a flotilla of 50,000 vessels ranging in size from I think passenger that's what I was to mobile whenever I played stations. the demo. Home to Maybe. 17 million Quarians, the flotilla understandably has scarce flotilla. resources. Because of this, each Quarian must go on a rite of passage known as the pilgrimage when they come of age. They leave the fleet and only return once Moss. they have found something of value they can bring back to uh -huh. their people. Other species tend to look down on the Quarians for creating the Geth and for the negative impact their fleet has when it enters a system. This has led to many myths and rumors about the Quarians, including the belief that underneath their clothes and breathing masks, oh. they are actually cybernetic creatures a combination of organic and synthetic parts. But it says that that's not true. This is led to many myths and rumors. Combat. Metagel is a common medicinal salve used by salve. paramedics, EMTs, and military personnel. Means. It combines several useful applications, a local anesthetic, disinfectant, and clotting agent all in one. Once applied, the gel is designed to grip tight to flesh until subjected to a frequency of ultrasound. It is sealable against liquids, most notably blood, as well as contaminants and gases. The gel is a genetically engineered bioplasm created by the CERTA Foundation, a medical technology megacorp based on okay. Earth. Technically, Metagel violates council laws against genetic engineering, but to date, it has proved far too useful to ban. Very interesting. All right. We can get rid of the mark. Why is that not the map button? Why is that not the map button? That's my question. Can I take this off? Clear destination. All right. Where? To CSEC Academy. Down. It is down the stairs. Or is it? That's my clinic. To CSEC Academy. Directions. Down the stairs. I'm sorry, what? Oh. I got a tour. One of 500 to see the ascension from the inside out. That's also what I thought he was talking about, for sure. Do I need to talk to this guy again in order to go in there? Hey, Commander Shepard. Good to see you again. See, sir. Anything you need? No. I have to go. Right. You're probably real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. <laughs> You're probably real busy. Sorry. Uh, 
Um, wait, we can't go in? Oh, here we go. So, Garrus, any regrets about leaving Seaside? Fighting a rogue specter with countless lives at stake and no regulations to get in the way? I'd say that being Seaside. Yeah, I would agree with True you. enough. I'd rather be fighting than trust it to somebody else. Flying V formation. This is the second time we've gone somewhere and just started lighting people up and no one said anything, no questions asked, and we're just we just walk away. Maybe we have suppressions on our lasers. This music is so good. Hello. One sec, looking you up. Don't you know who I am? Everyone knows me. John Shepard. Check your records. Commander Shepard, here with the Alliance military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? Sure How is. How did you know all that? I, I didn't ask him, I just said sure officer. is. I need to make sure our buyers are authorized. So, will you be purchasing anything today, Commander Shepard? No, because I'm I poor. I think I'll be going. Sure thing, Commander. You have a good day now. You take care now. Let's move it. Nice dress. Reminds me of something. Hey, Rex. There he is. Captain Rex. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This mm. is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. <laughs> oh, he kind of looks like Go the... Go on. Get out of here. Billy Bones. Do I know you, human? Billy Bones in uh, Treasure Planet. Old Billy Bones hand. Which is crazy because I literally just quoted Treasure Planet 10 seconds ago. Name Shepard. You will. Fist is mine. My name's Shepard. My name's Shepard. I'm going after Fist. Thought you might want to come along. <sighs> Shepard. Commander he even kind of sounds like him. I've heard a lot about you. We're both warriors, Shepard. Oh. Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a saying. Seek That's the us. Enemy of your enemy. We'll be your friend. You will find a friend. Welcome aboard. Glad to have you on the team. Oh, Rex. okay. He's actually. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist. Waiting. He actually. Oh my God. Oh, okay, just like that. I mean, sorry, a sorry, Ash. I'm gonna keep these guys for now. I can only have two at a time, just making sure. Wait, let's see what he has. He has biotic tech and combat strength. Yeah, he's he's pretty cool. Or not Rex. You're not Rex. Is there anything else in here to look at first? Okay, but we also know how to go. I wonder if there's a faster way to go to it this way. It doesn't give us any doors or anything, so probably not. Okay. See, we just we wouldn't have had him as a friend if we didn't go to him. Who's sure. Jalid? Hey there. Hello. Oh, you're not CSEC, are you? Nope. Did you want something? I overheard you. What were you trying to explain to the officer before? My colleague is trying to kill me. Oh, God. And I thought we were friends. That's a serious claim. How do you know he wants you dead? He's changed. He won't talk to me at work anymore, and he started following me. I don't know that that equates death, but... Yesterday, he followed me all the way home, just waiting for a chance. I don't care what anyone thinks. He wants me gone. I know it. What do you need? Is there something I can do? Talk to your friend, maybe? Would you? That's all I want. Someone to talk to him. Tell him to leave me Where is alone. He? Where is he, Jalid? He thinks he can just push me around, but you'll show him, won't you? Yes, I'll help. Just tell me where he is and I'll go find him. Oh, right. Well, he wanted to meet with me down in the wards near the markets. He said he just wanted to talk, but I know better. His name's Shorbin. Shorbin. He's a Salarian. You shouldn't have any trouble. Oh, just wait, scientist. we've talked to him. Sure, Ben. That's the guy who wanted us to scam the keepers. The keepers? Well, 
Even more reason to go after How did he how did that's against regulations? How did Garrus know about that? I see. I better look into this right away. Find out what he's up to. Anything's possible with Shorbin these days. Well, good luck. Let's see what he has to say about all this. I don't think Shorbin's a bad guy. Hello, Commander. Hello. It's impressive that they just know who I am just based on my looks alone. I forgot already where they told me that he was. Uh, Krogan Battlemaster. Creates a powerful mass effect field that immobilizes a single target. Oh, cool. Yolo. You know what? I think that this is fine. This gives him a nice balance of everything. Oh, cool! Wait. He looks he looks cool with the helmet on. Wait, why are they down there? Come here, boys. To me. Good or not. Okay, I kind of like your helmet's pretty cool. Wait, but if I if I come at him for you know tracking wait track. Okay. Two things. I'm learning oh, I'm getting lots of things here. Weapons locker. Casually yoinking stuff every from everywhere. I'm sure that they won't miss it. We got all these missions we got. Okay, assignments, I guess, are different than missions. Assignments are our side quests. I met a Volus scientist named Jalid. He's in the seasick offices and refused to leave for fear that his life is in danger. He claims his colleague, a Solarian named Shorbin, is trying to kill him. The details are a bit vague. Talk to Shorbin. Codex entries. Combat. Small All arms. modern infantry weapons, from pistols to assault rifles, use micro-scaled mass accelerator technology. Projectiles consist of tiny metal slugs suspended within a mass-reducing field, accelerated by magnetic force to speeds Wait, that inflict kinetic damage. The ammo magazine is a simple block of metal. The gun's internal computer calculates the mass needed to reach the target based on distance, gravity, and atmospheric pressure then shears off an appropriate sized slug from the block. A single block can supply thousands of rounds, making ammo a non-issue during any engagement. Top line weapons also feature smart targeting that allows them to correct for weather and environment. Firing on a target in a howling gale feels the same as it does on a calm day at the practice range. Smart targeting does not That's mean so a bullet will automatically find the mark every time the trigger is pulled. It only makes it easier for the marksman to aim. The fact that they have a way to explain how hitscan is working in this game is incredible. I'm just gonna be honest, I'm not gonna read these. I paid attention to everything, but like that stuff just doesn't feel like it would be even pertinent to me in any capacity, so. All right, let's go back to the club. If I can remember how to get there. Does anyone want to talk to in here, maybe? Nope. Can never hurt, though. Can never hurt to look. Go in here. No food. I mean, food? <laughs> hmm. I wonder what's on my mind. Couldn't possibly be food. Alright, what do all of these things go to? Okay, did it again. Oops, I did it again. Docking bay. Yeah, let's just go back the way we came. That'll probably be the fast way to get back to the place I know about Garrus, it. Knowing that the person behind all this death and destruction is a Turian Spectre. Ooh, talk to spec. Saren is either a traitor or a madman. Taking him down will restore the good name of Turians everywhere. Glad to hear it. I was losing sleep over the prospect <laughs> of people not loving the Turians. I like that uh, elevators are a place for like more dialogue to happen. And I guess depending on the, the characters that you have selected as your teammates, that'll change. That's a, that's a fun way to do that. Good job, devs. Good job. 
All right, let's see if we can remember. I think we went this way. Uh, or we could go this way. We also went this way. We've done both. Let's try this way first. There was Wong number two. No, because then we went down. Uh oh. We are going the long way around. Or is this the right turn? Maybe it is the right way to go. I'm not sure. Wait, there's an exclamation mark here. This has got to be it. Sh Wait, Shorbin? Where, where, where was Shorbin? He's right here. That was an accident. Commander, I wasn't expecting to see you again. Is there something you want? The truth. You can start by telling me the truth. Oh, God, don't snap on him like I'm that. I'm not sure what you're referring to. My experiments are... We're not buying it. Jaleed told us you've been after it. You spoke with Jaleed? Then you know about the data? No, but you're going to tell me everything. Yeah, yeah, true, true, true. You boys can go. Oh. Oh, they're protecting him. Looks like my plans have changed. It's not as bad as you think, Commander. Jaleed and I just got a little over our heads. Go on. Keep talking. The company we work for developed an experimental procedure for use in medical scanners. Jaleed and I saw even more potential, so we stole the plans and secretly developed a tool to scan the keepers. Just fine. Can you imagine a tool that can actually get readings from the keepers? That's it? That's what all this fuss is about? The keepers are almost impossible to scan, and you can't capture them or get samples. They just self-destruct. Oh, wow. After centuries okay. here, we still don't know anything about them. Don't you see? We were the first to scan them, ever. You've seen it yourself, Commander. You know we can do it. Angelide? Why are you trying to kill your partner? I'm not trying to kill him. Jaleed's job was to disseminate our initial findings. Disseminate. But he decided to keep the data for himself. Oh. I don't know. I sigh. So you're just trying to get back what Jaleed already stole. We lost our heads. We just couldn't let an opportunity like this pass us by. I mean, we're going to have to Commander, go back and talk to him. If you'll just continue gathering data for me, imagine what we might learn. And you'll stand to make a bit of a profit yourself, remember? All right. I suppose a little scanning here and there won't hurt anyone. Very good. Maybe if you wouldn't mind speaking with I Jaleed, am a carrier pigeon! If Jaleed won't help me analyze it. I'll go have a chat with him right now. Thank you. Mm. Happy scanning, Commander. Fine. I will go talk to him first. And then uh, we will go to the bouncer. Because I can't remember what his name is off the top of my head. What does this say it would take me to? Oh, wait. Hold up. Ward's locations? Cease. That's not what we want. Wait, maybe it is. Okay, wait, so these things can take you basically almost anywhere. Oh my god, oh, okay, so it's, okay. I thought they took you to like an individual direction, not like you can go anywhere based on just being on that bike. But it makes sense, because if you're flying through basically the atmosphere or whatever, I guess it's not really atmosphere. The space. Hello again. Did you have any luck finding short? Yes. I found out you've been lying to me, Jaleed. Correct. Lying? Why would I lie to you? You forgot to mention the data about the keeper. Uh, he told you? Mm-hmm. I didn't What do you have to say about yourself? I was afraid Shorbin would kill me to get the data, so I... Well, I was hoping you'd take care of him. We're in this I'm scanning the keepers for Shorbin, but you two need to stop fighting. You're... you're helping us? But... well, if you say so. Mm-hmm. Well, if Shorbin can forgive and forget, then so can I. I'm glad I to hear the it. Help, Commander. I better go get that data analyzed. Yes, you should. Well, that was... that was simple. Oops. 
And now I can just take the thing right back to the place. Hopefully even to just directly to the club. Ward's locations. Core's den. Gentlemen's club. Okay, this is where it took me last time. What does it say? No. Okay, yeah, yeah, here we go. I wonder, I mean, that's clearly part of their heads. It's shut down. Oh, Jesus. Oh, look at that. Adrenaline burst, marksman, warp. Didn't mean to do that, but what am I shooting at? Five shots. Yeah, take that. And now if I do this, map throw. Okay, cool. And then I'll use marksman. And then I can do this. Oh, what? Oh, they're up in the thing. Have all these abilities back. Oh no no no! Don't throw! Don't throw! Or do. I really don't like. There's got to be a better way to do this. I'm definitely doing something. Like that. Okay, that's just guns. All targets down. Oh, I was about to shoot him. It wouldn't let me. Stop right there. Don't come any closer. Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll shoot. Save yourselves. This would be a good time to find somewhere else to work. Yeah, yeah, right. That's a good idea. <laughs> no, I never liked Fist anyway. <laughs> it would have been quicker to just kill them. That was so fast. That was so fast. <laughs> How would it have been quicker? That literally took us two seconds. Weapon locker. Begin manual override. Oops. I wonder if anything bad happens for me not getting it the first time. Take all. Where are you at? Wait, what the? Oh, it's hurt. Ah, I'm dying! I'm dying! My first ever death. I didn't expect that guy to be such a tank. He was just eating shots like they were breakfast. Like oh, look at the thing. Did I hit him? This works in Mass Effect 2 because this does not seem efficient at all. Oh, this didn't even work. Ah! Oh. Dang. Lovely. What was he shooting? Oh. It wasn't my teammate. I remember seeing that from last time and I wanted to utilize it and so I got the chance. Stop right there. Don't come any closer. Warehouse workers. Stay back or we'll shoot. Save yourselves. This would be a good time to find somewhere else to work. God. Watch go fat. I like Garrus. I like his vibes. Oh my god, this guy is lighting me up. He's a demon. Oh, it 
its fist, that's why. We got him. We got him, boys. Wait! Don't kill me, I surrender! Smart move. Start talking. Tell me where the quarian is, and I won't have to shoot you in the kneecap. Oh! She's not here. I don't know where she is. That's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. I mean, you wait, really wait. wanted to, so... Wait, I don't so. know where the quarian is, but I know where you can find her. Where can the I find her? isn't here. Said you'd only deal with the shadow broker himself. I don't face like your, face, the cut of your jib. Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Should we let him kill him? Nobody meets the shadow broker. Ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Sarah. <sighs> for her. Oh my god. Give me the location. Now. Here on the wards. The back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them Oh right my now. god, you, you rat. What are you doing? The shadow broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. I mean, we knew that was going to happen. We knew that was going to happen. A lot of people died because of him. He had it coming. Now let's move. We have to save that quarian. Okay, that was kind of... The way we said that was kind of crazy, but we knew that that was... He told us that that's what he was going to do. Again, manual override. I don't know why he's acting surprised. All right, we gotta get out of here. Save the Quarian. Okay, there's a lot of enemies outside, it seems. Let me get ready. Map my throw, first of all. They didn't like it to kill their boss. Peek. Peek and see what happens, thug. I warned ya. Oof. Oh wait, I need to map. Come on. Do it just like your buddy did. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. You wanna play this way? I can play this way. Uh, uh. <laughs> Didn't mean to do that, that's okay. Am I getting healed by my teammates? What's going on? Quarry, what, there's a timer! Oh my God. Save. Let's do a new save. I didn't notice that there was a timer. Where am I going? Where did he even say? I forgot. Journal. Missions. Okay, this is, no. Has a range of meaning with a quarian who is evident. That's not, this is not the time. Saren's man is out of chat for the quarian. You have to find, get to the alley before they kill her. Where is the alley? Shut up. Is it this? Surely it's only gonna let me go to the direction that I need to go, hopefully. Here it goes. Okay, okay, we're here, we're here. I was panicking. Did you bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? Oh, they'll be here. Oh, Where's don't he touch her like that. Away. The deal's off. Tali Zora. Oh. Okay. I love her. Wait, why haven't I done that at all? One of these days, I'm gonna use the thing and it's actually gonna work. What the hell just happened to me? Set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Are you okay? Were you hurt in the fight? Oh, what's I know how to the look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate She's the badass. help. She's badass. Who are you? A friend. My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life, but not here. We need to go somewhere safe. Okay. We could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. 
It's true. What evidence do you have for us? We need to know everything. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards and all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? Who's this? <laughs> what are you up to, Shepard? Shut up and I'll Make tell you. Day, Loki, I wanted to say that option, but Lincoln we're trying to be a good guy, so... Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, miss... My name is Tali. Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. Tali Zora Naraya. Here. What a beautiful name. you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. Tali, Tali, My Tali. rite of passage into Ah, uh, this is the... Okay, we remember. I read about that. Or listened. I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars. They have the same mouth as the other guys, the though. Flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. And what did Tell you find? Us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the veil. I was curious. I can just see how much of Geth influence Destiny world. has on I this series. I become separated from its unit. Or and rather, vice versa. Its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. Go on. What did you find out? Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us mm -hmm. one step closer mm -hmm. to finding the conduit. The conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. We've got him. He said Eden Prime brought him one step closer to finding the I said conduit. we've got him and then still chose the other Any opposite, idea what that opposite means? thing. The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't Ooh, working alone. The Matriarch. Did we hear the Matriarch's voice as, voice as well? Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step Help me, closer Obi -Wan to Obi. finding the conduit. You're my only hope. And one step closer there it to is. the return of the Reapers. The Reapers. Don't fear I don't the recognize Reapers. that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. Reapers sounds familiar. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. Okay, so just at the, the same time as the other ones. The Reapers hunted total extinction and then they vanished. Oh, wow. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. She's right. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand oh, it now. Oh, wow. I saw the oh. Proteans being wiped out by the Reapers. Interesting. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The and does he? Is just going to I guess we'll find this. out. They need to know. They need to the know. Reapers are a threat to every species in Citadel space. We have Even to if they them. don't believe it, we have to no try. what they think about the rest of this, those audio files prove Saren's a traitor. Anderson clearly does have that personal right. element, but and still, that's okay, because he is right in this right particular instance. What about her? The quarry. Come with us, be my team. My name is Tali. My name is Anakin. You saw me in the alley. And I'm a human. You know hum what I can do. Let me come with you. I'm a person and my name is Anakin. That's, there it is. Tell me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Just let me come with you. You could be useful. I wonder if because I'm recording, re recording, recruiting so many people early on that it's actually stopping me from getting people later on. But I don't really care. I thought you were on your pilgrimage. Or maybe the I'm getting the guilt. The pilgrimage proves we are willing to give of ourselves for the greater good. What does it say about me if I turn my back on this? I agree. Saren is a danger to the entire galaxy. My pilgrimage can wait. Join us. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. Come you with me. This. And we'll Anderson be and I will go ahead and in the world of your imagination. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. All right, let's take... For now, let's take Garrus and Tali. Oh, they're both techie people. That's okay, though. Why can't I choose them? Anti squad, anti squad. Oh, she's in incredibly techie. 
I'll hold down the biotic stuff for us. And then they can they can do the other the other stuff. Accept squad. Come with me and you'll be in a world of your imagination. I think I don't know this, but I think that Paragon is our light side and Renegade is our dark side. I wish that there was a way to like look at the stuff over there and have it give me a description. And I think that I got a little bit of the dark side juice because I wasn't even upset that he killed the guy. That's just my thought process, but I don't know for sure. Um, what happens if I do two of these? Increase warp effect radius and duration allows it to be used more often. I'm gonna be honest. I don't feel like I need this because it's kind. These abilities are a little bit annoying. I'm not a big fan of the way that it looks. Increases melee damage. Increases melee. Melee. Increases weapons damage. What is what is the two of these things? Tactical armor unlocked. I don't know what that means either. Let's do. Weapon damage by one, melee damage by 30. Is that why my melee is like whooping their asses? <laughs> Pistol Jogon by five. And then this does five and 10. For me being a pistol and shotgun person, it's interesting that I can't level up shotguns at all. What's lift? What? Why can't we do lift? I want to do lift. Okay, it's fine. You know what? No. No. I can't make up my mind. I'm so indecisive. Oops. Temporarily disables enemy biotics since tech with a certain radius. That's sick. 14. What happens if we do auto? Skip rain talents. Seems fine to me. Because we also have the guy and he does a lot, so. Quarry Mechan Mach Machinist, however you say this. Though young, Tolly's a true genius when it comes to dealing with mechanical or electronic equipment. Increases tech resistance, increases shields. We need the electronics on for sure. All restore whenever you repair a vehicle. Let's use electronic skills to repair or buy. Let's do. Let's take away one. Let's take. It's like one of her decryptions away, because that's this. Oh. Take one of the decryptions away, because this is the same as. How do I do this? It doesn't let me. Unless I do this. Damping unlocked. Whatever that means. Alright, there you go. Turn to the tower. You should be where be there when the ambassador presents the Quarian's evidence. Yeah. Okay. Makes sense to me. Information you found in Fist's hideout will help Miss Wong with her report on corruption. Go to the upper wards to deliver it to her. Can I mark this? No. Continue to scan the keepers. We'll continue to do that. That's fine. It's Ten out of twenty. Okay. Go to the Hydra system in the Argos Rogue Cluster and investigate. That'll come later. First by Conrad Werner. He seemed like a harmless fan. You probably haven't seen the last of Conrad. What harm will be in talking to them if we meet him again? Okay. Conrad is the fan. Now let's go, let's go to Miss Wong and then we'll go to the thing. Upper wards to deliver it to her. Okay. Armor upgrade stimulant pack. Oh. What did I just do right now? A Volus manufacturer based in the terminus system, the Elkos Combine produced less expensive versions of items carried by high-end manufacturers. Functional yet affordable armor, weapons, and omni tools are available from the Elkos Combine. Oh, I see, I see. 
LB. Where does it even say that LB does that? It doesn't. Hmm. Very interesting. Uh, oh, there it is. Details. I see it. It's right there. Arm piercing rounds two. Arm piercing rounds two. Arm piercing rounds two. Seems my cat is woken up. Absorb dissipates heat energy generated when firing a weapon. Block your weapon radar. Ah, that's why that was doing that. Okay. Let's do heat sink. And this is ass compared to what we're wearing right now. So we can just go ahead and omni gel it up. We can't wear that yet, so. But nope, didn't mean to do that. But we can do this. Baby. Ha ha ha! Armor equipped with Stimpaks released targeted shots of adrenaline to speed up recovery and recharge times. Done. Easy. All right. Miss Wong, my juice! Mrs. Hawkins, my juice! Oh my god, where am I? It's a party in here. Hello there, human. Hello there, Zilton. Sincere apology. But yes. Okay. So these guys, they talk. Distracted right now. They speak like they're sarcastic, but I think that they're very genuine. They just are very monotone, and that's okay. There's nothing wrong with that. You seem distressed. Is there something I can do to help? Oh, the eyebrow movement we did. Response. You overheard that, did you? This is all going so Asari wrong. consort. And it is the Asari consort's fault. She's the one who started all this. What happened? Consort. Who's this Asari consort? Curious. You have not heard. Shaira. You must be new to the Citadel. Everyone knows Shaira. 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 I cannot speak more about Okay, so this is still that same person that was too sensitive. in that other area that Suffice they talked about last say, time. She has compromised my authority as a diplomat. Where is she? Where can I find this Asari consort? She is across the bridge from here. Her offices are easy enough to spot. Good day. Good here. day to you, Zeltan. Hi, baby. Earth Clan, you are in the wrong place, I think. I don't appreciate your attitude, your Din. Your ambassador is next door in the large office. Chastising remark. <laughs> don't be so rude, Din. At least introduce. I like yourself. these guys. I need to find out what their race is called. I don't remember. I am Din Korlak, Volus Ambassador. Is there something I can do for you, Earth Clan? I don't like the way y'all call me Earth Clan. What is this place? You are in the embassy for the Volus and the Elcor. Okay, you're Volus there, Elcor. Your ambassador is next door, in his own office. I got Eeyore to voice these guys. In this shared space, I aid my fellow Volus when I'm not being interrupted. I'd like to know more about the Volus. I'm sure our history and culture okay. will bore you, Earth clad. I literally am asking you. Actually, I would like to know more about your history. My people came to the Citadel. You could just tell he was itching to talk to me about it. Oh, it would bore you. We you don't want to know, do you? Oh, okay. Establishing a standardized galactic economy. However, despite our long association with the Citadel and our many contributions to galactic society, we still do not hold mm, a seat on the So he's salty. Now we start to get getting down to brass tacks of why he is so angry at us. He's angry because they're not on the council. Well, we're not even a specter, so we have that in common. We should get along better. Tell me about Volus culture. We are tribal by nature, but our ways are not violent. We barter and trade our lands and tribe members in order to increase status. Makes sense. Larger tribes often engulf smaller ones and eventually split again. Our society is very malleable. And our government Malleable? Is shifting and changing. No, that's not how that word Since is pronounced. Not physically adept, we trade our services it's malleable, isn't it? Uh, did I just learn something new? I swear to God, it's always been malleable. Why so cranky? You seem to have a bit of a chip on your shoulder, Din. 
you Din humans Djarin. are new to the citadel, and yet the council has granted you great faith. Wait, have they though? Chastising rebuke, Din. Your species has always been granted many concessions. Hmm. Golas territory has expanded tenfold since coming to the citadel. <laughs> Details. We still have no real say in the decisions that affect but, citadel But nor do space. we, though, is the thing. What is it you do here? I look out for the best interests of the Volus people. No easy task considering how often we are overlooked, overlooked by the council. <laughs> rebuke, yes, he's dear. short. The council favors your species greatly. You are naive. The Earth Clan will be invited to the council long before our species will. Council admits. Why aren't the Volus or Elcor part of the council? That's a good question. All species must prove themselves before they join the council. All but Wait, the we're not part of we're not see. part of the council, are we? I thought it was just those three. Ignore the Volus ambassador, human. He is incorrect okay. in his assessment. I have to Google really? something. How long have we Did been Bioware waiting? also do Nice Old Republic? Because it we'll feels so similar. Bah, this talk is wasted on the humans. It's not loading. I have no internet connection. Fine. Whatever. Oh. Created and developed by Bioware. Okay, I was about to say, because this is, it's so unbelievably similar. There are just so many things that are so similar. I would have been flabbergasted if they weren't made by the same. Yes, yes. Good day, Earth Clan. In that exact moment, I was thinking that him and saying his, like, chastising remarks and stuff, he seemed so much like... HK-47, which some of you may know who I'm talking about and some of you may not. But HK-47 talks almost identically to that. Inquiry. Meat bag. All right, what is this orange X? Samesh Batia. Excuse me, Commander Shepard. Could you spare a moment of your time? I could. Commander Shepard, my name is Samesh Batia. Hello, so much. Intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. I'm happy to help. It's no trouble. What can I do for you? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 oh, no. on Eden Prime. I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Did they say why? Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. I'll find out. We'll look into it. The man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral and the respect she deserves. As any person would want to in a position like yours, you are valid. I guess we can just go back up here. I'm imagining this is the same bar as where we went that other time. Hi, baby. This man right here. He looks he looks like he'd prevent a, a woman's body from being activities made for quite burned. a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? I'm here for yes. Samesh. A man named Samesh Batya is having some trouble claiming his wife's body. Ah, Mr. Batya. Awkward. A good man in an understandably frustrating position. I wish I could help him. Serviceman Narali Batya died on Eden Prime, as Mr. Batya no doubt told mm -hmm. you. What else? Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. Why didn't you just tell him that? That is why her body is being held. She's toxic? You think her body might be dangerous or contaminated? No, Commander. Nurali Batia is not dangerous. Her body is, in fact, extremely valuable to the Alliance. The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Just tell him that. Serviceman Batia may save more lives in death than she did in life. I'll, I'm gonna, Samesh should hear this. I'll tell Samesh. Next time you cut up a dead soldier, at least tell her husband the truth. That was just the reaction we were hoping to avoid, Commander. But if you think it will help, tell Mr. Batia the truth. 
Perhaps you will understand. I didn't mean to, it to be Please that let me forceful. Know if you have any other questions? I didn't mean it for it to be as forceful and scary as that was. That was like an intimidate option without even using intimidate abilities. Um. Oh, wrong way. Wait, but there is a spider in here. Keep her even. He was so calm too. I grabbed him by the <laughs> by the throat, and he just sat there and just took it. Don't make it Hello, weird. Commander. Has any progress been made with Mr. Bosker? Will he return my wife's body? There's a problem. It's not as simple as I'd hoped. The military needs your wife's body for important tests. Tell more tests? details. They're holding my wife's body for tests. My wife served the Alliance faithfully. She gave her life for humanity. And this is how they repay her. Should I do this as important? We'll fix this. I'll work on it. This is important. Mr. Bacha, your wife died defending humanity. We still need her help. What right does the military have to hold her body? She's already given her life. What would she want? She did it willingly. If the military had asked your wife to submit to tests to save human lives, what would she have said? It doesn't matter. Okay. She's dead. I just want her to come home. I miss her so much. That's fair. I'm sorry. Let them run their tests. Let Aww. my wife save lives so that others are spared the loss I feel today. <laughs> Goodbye. Thank you for finding me answers. I'm sorry they weren't the answers you were hoping for. Paragon plus eight. That's not good. I didn't handle that properly. I'm gonna do some research before we do our next video. I'm gonna find out what Paragon is versus the other thing. The Volus are a member species of the Citadel with their own embassy, but they are also a client race of the Turians. Centuries I ago, think it's they bad. I don't, I don't think that I wanted that. Effectively trading their mercantile prowess for Turian military protection. Erun, their homeworld, lies I don't think I did anything wrong. I think- zone of its star. However, the world has a high pressure greenhouse atmosphere. I think that the that traps in that I was to support an baited biochemistry. As a result, the dialogue options didn't see as bad as seem as bad as they when dealing with ended other up species being. as conventional nitrogen oxygen air mixtures are poisonous to them. And in the low pressure atmospheres tolerable to most species, their flesh will I'm actually sorry. I guess I go back and talk to this guy just because. I feel bad. That would be really tough on any person. So of course he had every right to be upset. Is he gonna say anything? Oh, he's not even there anymore. Heck. I know there's a spider out here. You're just gonna say, oh, the database. Level up. Level up, level up, level up. I love that they're just ready to go at a moment's notice. I should just go for the ones that have another ability. Tactical armor. Sure. They really disable saving about X sensor. I think I should focus on her getting more electronics. Asana. I don't have time to talk now. I'm very busy. Watch the way you talk to me. Catching you up. Okay. Who was that other person I wanted to talk to? That girl. Em Emily. I don't think that's her name. Miss Wong. Miss Wong with her report on corruption. Go to the upper wards. Just upper wards. It doesn't give me any specific directions. Just upper wards. Upper wards. Welcome to Presidium Tourism Terminal 1. 
Oh, we already done this. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel Tower, where the Council meets regularly to discuss matters of interstellar importance. Goodbye. Goodbye, and thank you for Goodbye. using Goodbye. Please enjoy your visit to the Citadel. You know I will. Presidium wards, upper wards. How do I go to upper wards? I don't think that any of that is what I want. Wards access. This might be right, I'm not sure. You've arrived at Presidium Plaza, Presidium upstairs. What is the... Citadel Tower, Embassies in CSEC. That's gonna be the same thing. He's still preaching. What happens if I look at the thing now? Map. Rapid Travel Bank, Emporium, Citadel Tower, CSEC, Dina's Office, Consort Chambers, Emporium. Heck! I don't know where I'm going. Let's just go to the Citadel Tower, turn around, and then go left. I'm so very clearly lost and don't know how to get to upper so we'll get there when we get there. Please do not disturb the oh, keepers. sorry. My bad. Moving on up. There's no way the council can ignore us this time. Saren's days as a specter are done. True. It must be. I mean, like, you hear his voice saying it. Very Portal-esque music in there. I love the autumn vibes of the Citadel. Whoa! Whoa! Fountain's going crazy. This woman is still watching this. She really loves these fountains. It brings her joy, I guess. There's nothing wrong with that. Oh, hello again. Oh, no, you're just still sitting there. Same guy. Maybe, but I wouldn't believe everything you hear. Oh, what are these guys That's talking about? It. I'm hearing it everywhere. It's not just isolated rumors. Do you really think Saren could be involved in something like that without the council? Mm, everyone's talking about it. Surely they must believe it now. Surely, if even lowly people like this are saying it, then Come on. it must be true. Udina's presenting the Quarian's evidence to the council. Why are they calling her the Quarian? She's right here. Her name is Tali. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the oh, return of the Reapers. This? You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Nice. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. Good that they just immediately believed it. I recognize believed the it. other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. Benezia. Who's she? Matriarchs are powerful Asari who have entered the final stage of their lives. Revered for their wisdom and experience, they serve as guides and mentors to my people. Matriarch mm. Benezia is a powerful biotic and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. What happened I'm to brought us to this point? I'm interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. Saren's bringing them back. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this Conduit is? Not yet. Saren thinks he can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy. It's just like Halo. Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? If they were real, we'd have found something. The Reapers are real. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Oh! Don't make the same mistake. Again. I kind of like the attitude with this, this is though. Different. You proved Saren betrayed the council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the conduit, but we don't really know why. 
The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Seren's true purpose. A uh, legend okay. he is using to bend the Geth to his will. <sighs> 50,000 years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the conduit, it they really mis are again. misleading with what they tell you Saren you're going to say. Saren is a agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is not good enough. You know he's hiding somewhere I love this guy's in the voice. Traverse. Send your fleet in. He's a good doctor. A fleet cannot track down one man. A Citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus system. Oh, I was right. It was you Terminus. I did remember properly. Over a few dozen human colonies. Send me. Saren down. The commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require. Give me Spectre status. No, it's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. I'm the best solution. I'm ready. It's the best solution. I'm ready. I faced Saren on Eden Prime and exposed him for a traitor. I've proven myself. If I could raise one eyebrow like that, I would do it. That just looks weird. Beep, boop, boop. Commander Shepard. They're on Step there. Forward. Segways. Guys, it's happening. It's happening. Tense music. Oh my god, everyone's watching me. I'm getting nervous. <laughs> it is the decision of the Council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Spectre is not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, the embodiment of courage, determination. Self-reliance. Yeah, we are. Hand of the council, instruments of our will. Spectres I don't know how I like great bird. being called an instrument. They are protectors but... of galactic peace, both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre commander. This is a great accomplishment for second. To entire Caesars. I'm honored, Counselor. We're sending you into the Traverse after Sarah. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. Any, leads? any idea where to find him? We will forward any relevant files to Ambassador Udina. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Got my Spectre badge. You can't tell me what to do anymore. Commander. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the C sec and Academy back to the C sec and Academy. Speak to the Spectre requisitions officer. Anderson, come with me. I'll need your help to set all this Spectre up. Spectre inductee. Yippee! I thought the ambassador would be a little more grateful. He didn't even thank you. Ah, it's no big deal. He's got a lot on his mind. Come on, right behind you, Shepard. Aww, I like Garrus. Spectre training talent unlocked. Ah, uh, elite agents of the council has been in a lot increases health, accuracy, and effectiveness, effectiveness of all attacks and powers. All right, let's just try and get this bad boy up. Why do I have an intimidate point? When did I do an intimidate point? Wait, why is my charm all the way up here now? What the hell's going on? Just because I became a specter, this happened. I guess so. I believe in you, auto level up. Do my do my people do my people well, please. I didn't even check. I probably should have. The ambassador will provide you with a ship and a crew. Meet him at the Alliance Docking Bay, accessible through the uh, central elevator in the Seasec Academy. But I want to find Mrs. Wong or Miss Wong even.
Yeah, it only takes me to the places that I've been, though. I'm still going to try this. I'm going to try this one more time. If I go here... Let's go over here. Because we haven't been here before. To all towers and wards. To embassies, so we're definitely going the wrong way. To CSEC Academy. Whatever. Since we're already here, might as well. Embassy receptionist. Hello. Is there something else I can help you with? Oh, we've already talked to her. I already, already talking to her. What the heck is wrong with me? Wait a second. I thought this is where I was supposed to be. CSEC Academy is different than CSEC HQ. Probably is what the problem is. I wonder, surely we'll be, end up coming back here because this is where the council is. So it's not like a, if I don't do everything right now, I don't get to do it again type of situation. That would be absurd, right? Surely not. Let's check over here real quick. See what see what it says. See what happens. To see sec and embassies. Oh look, a spider. I've had my office rearranged five times. Nice. What's in here? Nelina. Welcome. I am Nelina. I don't Nelina. recognize you as one of our expected clients today. Would you like me to see when the consort will be able to meet with you? I need a Can't appointment? I just go in? Mm, I'm afraid not. Mm. Yeah, you must understand there eh. are many who seek the consort services. But if you wish to leave your name, she'll make every effort to meet with you. Commander Shepard, I'm with the Spectres. Oh, Excellent. We can you say we're a Spectre now. Three or four months. Nobody's worth that much of a wait. <laughs> well, that's I'm a Spectre. To Let me in. And you'll be contacted. Is there anything else? What is the consort? What does she do? Mm, it's difficult to explain. She's many things to mm. many people and something different for Sounds each. sussy. Some seek her for advice, some for entertainment, others still for pleasure. Most of the time, our clients won't realize what they were seeking until after she has provided is she it for them. mystical? You make her sound like some kind of oracle. No, not in the usual sense. She's merely a woman. A woman with remarkable compassion and a generous spirit. I suggest you make an appointment and see for yourself. What do you do here, Nalina? I'm one of the consorts. I like athletes. the name Nalina as well. Many of the people here today will not see the consort, but they expect to be attended to just the same. Just it's like me. It's our job to ensure that they leave contented. Oh. What exactly do you attend to? Well, each acolyte has her unique abilities. Oh. Some soothe with song, others with conversation. What is your ability? As much as possible, we seek to match the needs of our clients to the skills of our acolytes. My specialty is touch. My fingertips can find every tension point in your body. I need her. I need her in my life. I'd like to try out your services. Excellent. I'll add you to our client list. We should be able to see you in mm, three or four months. I think I'm done here. Oh, well, I hope you'll return again in the future. We always enjoy seeing new clients. Nalina. Yes, Shaira? Send the commander up to see me. I wish uh, to speak with him. Hold up. Special privileges. Yes, of course, mistress. Okay, wait, why is she touching that wall so seductively? It appears the consort has taken notice of you. She'd like to meet with you now. Because I'm a specter. Where do I go? Oh God. Just head upstairs. She'll be waiting for you. Don't try any funny business with me now. Okay, wait, where am I? So interesting. Client talk. I see even the humans find the consort irresistible. Okay. Even the humans? Is that necessary? So much empty space. A thousand of my people could live here and hardly even see each other. 
What's this? You're with the Alliance? My brother's a No one, no on one cares. Door control. Hello, Shaira. Nice office orb. Jesus Christ. God, just scared the shit out of me. Your arrival here in our citadel. What do you want? You wanted to speak with me? I have a certain problem that could use your expertise. Tell me about it. Maybe I can help. I have a friend, Septimus. Septimus. A retired Turian general. I won't discuss the details, but he wanted me to be more than I could be. Mm. We had a falling out. Now he spends his days in Cora's den, drinking and can't spreading say, lies Can't take nose. If you would speak Why do to I want to help him? Fellow soldier, oh. I believe he will listen to you and let the matter be. What went wrong? What happened between you? I respect his privacy too she much. She said that's to as close as you can come and then came over and touched me in the if face. If he wishes to tell you what happened, that is his prerogative. I'll see. I don't make any promises, but I'll see what I can do. Thank you, Commander. That is all I can ask. Appeal to a sense of honor. Remind him of his position as a general. If you can convince him to stop spreading lies about me, I would be very grateful. Now I must ask you to take your leave. I have many clients waiting to see me. I have to admit I'm a little nervous. That's understandable. Men are a little unsure. Hmm. I went very often when it was still the Arcos. Yeah, ever since Lovely. I don't go anymore. I'll be so happy to help her. Favor to a friend, of course. My cat has jumped into a giant box and I think is stuck inside of there because it's a giant vertical box. And I don't even know if she can get back out. Human. I love their voices. This one is greatly pleased to see you here in my decadent emporium. So long. <laughs> this one's face name is Delaninder, though many in this place simply refer to it as Delan. Delan. Please take time to examine the fine goods it has for purchase. Nope, I'm All bored. Great worth. I think I'll be going. Return soon. This one receives new shipments regularly. Helena. Got a moment. Hello, Spectre. I have a business proposition for you. Everyone knows me you know I'm a Spectre? for this being a trillions of people on this thing. Your name comes up in certain circles. There's so I'm many. I'm acquainted with a pair of powerful crime bosses. They're hiding on remote people worlds, that just know me. and I have the coordinates. You could do the galaxy a favor. What kind of defenses would these two have? I haven't the faintest idea, but they're certain to be armed. Their partnership soured, and each believes that the other intends to kill him. They will be well prepared. Hmm. And what do you get out of this? We share interests. You in are lying cooperative through your teeth. Ventures, I have no idea what you're talking but their about. Their business practices have forced me to terminate our relationship. Oh, Once she made it dead, up. I will manage our organization in a more tasteful manner. Mm. Find someone else to do your dirty work. I want no part of a gang war. Here are the coordinates, nonetheless. What you do with them is your decision. Could you really let these men live, knowing that you can stop them? Goodbye, Commander. It's been a pleasure to meet you. Mm. Oh, Paragon, good. Paragon is good. Renegade is bad. I got good. Wait, I don't actually know that that means what that means. But I got Paragon points for the guy and his wife's body stuff. So this is so maybe I actually got good points. I think we're gonna leave it right there for today. Uh, we got promoted to Spectre, which is huge for us, and we're about to run down there and get training or whatever. Um. I think that it will let us come back here, so there's no way that we're gonna have to grind out every single side quest 
on this one area right now at the beginning. I think for sure we'll come back here. If we can't, that would be actually shameful or a shame. Um, but hopefully it'll allow us to just come right back through. But anyway, that's going to do it for today's video. If you enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.